Some people are afraid to answer the most obvious question. Is that a baby? That's the most obvious question. That face, that nose, those two eyes, that mouth, that chin, those fingers, is that a baby? That's really the only question. Is that a child? Maybe there's a second question that needs to be answered. Are all children valuable? Or are only some children valuable? Gold is valuable. Doesn't matter its size. I have gold in my wedding ring. Many people have gold in their wedding rings. If we found a small piece of gold on the floor, it would be valuable. It wouldn't matter its shape, wouldn't matter its size, small or large. We don't discriminate. Gold is valuable because everyone universally recognizes its worth. Every single senator in this room recognizes the worth and value of gold. It's around $1,800 an ounce right now to be able to get gold. We all seem, no matter how small or large, gold is valuable, but we can't seem to agree that all children are valuable. Literally, gold is more precious to some people in this room than children are. Children aren't valuable only sometimes, or only certain children. Children are valuable. It can't be just if a mom or dad wants a child, they're valuable, and if they don't want a child, they're not valuable, they're disposable. If the mom or dad gets to choose who are precious and who's medical waste, is that a child? That's really the only question that has to be answered. If I ask, is that a child, people respond, well, do you spend enough for child care or health care? And I still say, wait, stop answering my first question. Is that a child? Maybe I should ask a more basic question. Does everyone in this room believe in the principle we should do unto others as we would want done unto us? What would you want done to you when you were in the womb? 